hello everyone my name is Parish and welcome back in another video on just a tech youtube channel so today i'm going to show you how you can jailbreak ios 13.6 beta 3 those who don't know how to install ios 13.6 on your iphone or your ipad you can watch my previous video in that i have shown in detail way how you can install ios 13.6 safely without pc without computer and without data loss so first watch that video all links are in description you can check out there okay so now to jailbreak ios 13.6 you will need a checkrin iso file for checkrin 0.10.2 version you can use my custom own iso file for checkrin or you can use bootrain or checknix the one which are supported by your pc you can use that so first we will make bootable usb pen drive that obviously you will need a pen drive for that so first we will make bootable then we will see the full process and if you are a beginner and don't know much about jailbreaking with checkrain and how to make bootable all the links are in description of detailed jailbreak video and you will get the readme file in which all things are written so you can check this iso file support all the pc that means you can run this file on uefi or old legacy bios for intel amd 32 bit and 64 bit so you can use rufus software only rufus will work belenage will not work so first read the instruction file and then follow the process you will get the rufus software inside the downloaded folder so just run rufus and after that just insert your usb and then import the iso file of the checkrin 0.10.2 and then make the bootable After importing the checkrain ISO file, just click on start to make the bootable process and one more thing just connect to internet while making bootable. After the complete bootable process, just close the Rufus software and reboot your PC. So after reboot just go to your boot options and then you will see the UEFI mode and the old legacy mode both option will available as per your requirement so the one which are supported you can choose it supported both options 32 bit 64 bit intel and amd so you can choose UEFI mode or old legacy bios mode also so i will show you both the modes this one is UEFI mode and if you have a old pc then you can use the old legacy mode also it will also work so as you can see you can choose the old legacy bios also now connect your i device to the computer and after that you will see on the screen your iphone model is supported but the ios 13.6 is not supported so in that case you have to first go to the options on the checkrain app and then you have to allow the first option that is allow untested ipad os ios and the tv os so first allow the first option and then go back and then you will see it will allow the ios 13.6 to jailbreak so make sure that when you jailbreak ios 13.5.1 and 13.6 you have to allow the first option and then you have to jailbreak and after that you will see some warning on the screen just ignore that click on ok and begin to the jailbreak process this method will work for all the ios that is 12.3 to 13.5.1 plus 13.6 you can jailbreak with this if you are using 13.5.1 you have to allow the first option and for the ios 13.6 you have to allow the first option for the same so after that just put on your recovery mode and then dfu mode and it will start jailbreaking process And in the end you will see all done that means your jailbreak is completed. If you face any error while jailbreaking just put in recovery mode and manually and then start jailbreaking bobus mode and the save mode option on the checkrain app and then you can try the jailbreak. And after 5 to 10 seconds you will see the checkrain loader app on your home screen and just connect to the Wi-Fi so that it will install Syria. 
As you can see, the Checkrun app is on my home screen. Now just open it. After that, just click on Cydia and install Cydia. And normally it will install Cydia. Now Cydia is installed successfully. So now we have successfully jailbreak our iOS 13.6. As you can see the iOS version on the Cydia app also. So this is how you can jailbreak iOS 13.6 with Checkrain easily. So let me show you the iOS version so that it will be confirmed I am on iOS 13.6. And if you want to go back to your Windows machine just quit the Checkrain app and on the terminal you have to type reboot and press on enter. And then you have to unplug your USB and then you have to straight back to your Windows machine. So for this make sure you hit the like button and if you are new here subscribe to my channel for more cool updates. So till then goodbye take care and peace out.